Hi, I'm John Kidd. I'm board chair of Delaware Friends of Folk. We are continuing a series of uh, presenting local musicians in, um, in Delaware uh, Historic and Cultural Affairs facilities. They are sponsoring a series of concerts by uh, out-of-work musicians during this uh, crazy coronavirus time. And today we're in Sussex County, we're in Lewis, Delaware. We're in the uh, really intriguing Zwenendale Museum here in Lewis. And we have uh, a local musician with us today. Please welcome Brian Scar. Thank you for that lovely introduction, John. Appreciate it. I'm going to kick things off with a song I wrote back in 2016 called Deep Blue Clouds. It's called Dire Times. Where it is safe. So here we go 
it's another day in clean and watch TV. Liquor's almost gone along with my sanity. But I'm thankful for the ones who's out on the front lines. Work and sacrifice in these dire times. Hauling up my SUV, dust upon my keys. Since I found out I can't get delivery, and my family all got Zoom today to me to keep in touch. It's times like these when you feel that love the most. So here we go. Another day clean and watch TV. My liquor's almost gone, along with my sanity. But I'm thankful for the ones who's out on the front lines, helping everyone in these dire times. So let's all do our part. This guitar is from 1977, and actually one my uncle got. He was a Delaware musician back in the 80s and 90s. His name was Randy Tenev. Unfortunately, he passed away when I was fairly young, so I didn't really get to know him too well. And when he passed away, a lot of his instruments were divvied up along with family. Um, some of them were even given to his friends, such as this guitar. It was given to a friend of his with the stipulation that it had to return to the family if my brother or sister or I got into music. And it wasn't until I was around 13 that I started picking up guitar. And after about three years, my parents said, I think he's taking it a little serious. So they called the friend up. Uh, very thankful he still had the guitar. And I got it when I was 16. Don't ask me to remember what year that was, because I can't <laughs> at the moment. But uh, anyway, I'm very glad to have gotten the guitar. Unfortunately, when I got it, much like with old guitars, the uh, pick guard started to curl up and the uh, saddle here started to pop up. And that's just the techniques they used to adhere to the guitar. But I got it fixed by a guy named Junior Wilson. He's a, yeah, you know, he's up in Milford. And I got the pick guard made by a fellow up in New York. Uh, the horse is actually a design that I made and he was able to cut it out in different pieces of wood and put it on there. And uh, I'm just going to let it play it. There's nothing like a Martin guitar. So with this guitar, I'm going to do a tribute to uh, one of my influences, a little Johnny Cash. Oh, 
like ours mean. I fell for you like a child. satisfied with how it was written because I felt like it was missing something and I still wasn't conveying the message I wanted. And it wasn't until recent events with George Floyd and Breonna Taylor that the song kind of came together. And I think Nina Simone said it best when she said, an artist's duty is to reflect the times in which we live. And I think if you don't do that, then what's the point? I mean, anyone can write a love song, but this is happening now. So you have to tell the story and convey it. And so this one I wrote, it's called Torch. Words are spoken to the thing Beneath the pale cotton gown Pieces don't get the stone When paranoia stands its ground And it's quiet seen downtown of generations life kind of got me into a lot of her music. 
actually a lot of the uh, stuff from the 40s and 50s. She's got that pinup style going. And we seem to go together like peanut butter and jelly, I would say. And last year, around this time, we actually had the unique opportunity of staying at Patsy Klein's house in, I think it's Goodsville. It's right outside of Nashville, or it's within you know, the suburbs. And that was quite an experience. And while we were down there, we slept in the basement area. Apparently that's where she held a lot of parties. Johnny Cash came over, a few others, Loretta Lynn, obviously was a huge uh, a friend of Patsy Klein. And we got to sit on the staircase, there's this famous picture of Loretta Lynn on that staircase playing a guitar. I don't know who took the picture, but it was in that area. Anyways, we were down there, and it was around, I want to say 11 at night. I was going to the bathroom, and I could have sworn I heard something move. There's some kind of ghosts going there. And the owners who bought the house said they have heard certain things in the house. Like they'll be down in the basement and you could swear they're hearing a woman wearing high heels up on the main floor. So whether it's haunted, I don't know. I'm not really a big believer in ghosts. So I'm just telling you what I heard. Anyway, this is the classic of Patsy Pines. Doesn't start like that though. <laughs> there we go. Hold on. <laughs> How's the song go? There we go. Take two. No, that ain't right. That's it. John's like, come on, boy, get it. I'm like, I'm getting it. song, guy from up in uh, PA, and uh, this is one of his lesser known ones probably, it's called Hard Time Losing Man, it's all good to go. Well you think you see the road, well you're looking at a man, oh, oh. 
Walk through the street, hard luck story, how time is man. You know sometimes God's got you know sometimes God's do. Sometimes say to be there, sometimes very too. Sometimes I feel like I should go far, far away and hide. Why go around town to see the man who's smoking off big sky? No mother thought the rock of the bed, up down man and well. He said, boy, I got a car, to pay for you, it's cleaner than boat and hell. Get on the highway, woo! Or get a van, or get a bump. Well, then I found a bottle car, and together my wife, a couple of hunks of wine. Well, you think it's in trouble? We're looking at a man of God Walk through the heart of the story Not that news man We had a bright night Feeling right Get out on the street Standing in the doorway Was a deal unknown in speed We sold the battle to find Down on the Mexican all that night, trying to get back, but that's a regular blue. Where you think you're looking at the man of God? What world do you reach? Hard luck story, how time is man. Where you think you're looking at the man of God? What world do you reach? Hard luck story, how time is man. What world do you reach? No hard luck story. Our time is May. The last song I'm going to do for you is called Kentucky or Delaware. It's one I wrote in February of this year. I had spoken to a program that kind of similar to this. They let independent artists come on their show. They did an interview and a few songs. And we had scheduled something to be shot in August and it was either I fly down to Kentucky or I wait till they come up here because they were going to film up in Salisbury or down in Salisbury I should say. But you know when the COVID hit everything kind of got derailed and I tried talking to them again and never heard so hopefully they're still in business or if not well it is what it is that's show business as they say. And so the song was written off the choice of either coming out in Kentucky or staying here in Delaware. And it's kind of had nothing to do with the program, but just more or less the love of you have for two places and having to choose. Caught in between Two love affairs. One wants to run, the other to sail. No, I'm not quite sure what way to go. And I'm torn in the middle of what I must. Something 
about deep rolling hills and in the purple evening my set in the still but then there's dunes fell on the bay with the wind of the ocean sail